Welcome to the MindView Concept Mapping Tutorial. This tutorial is designed in conjunction with the F.A. Davis textbook. To begin working with the MindView Concept Mapping software, you must first download and install the correct version. You can download the PC or the Mac platform software. Once the software is installed, you can go ahead and download the corresponding patient care template. Most standard internet browsers will download files into your local downloads folder. To locate that file, simply launch your documents, choose the downloads folder, and locate the patient care template. By double left clicking on that file, it will launch within the MindView concept mapping software. For those of you that are new to concept mapping software, a concept map is a central idea or topic with branches that radiate outward and corresponding connection lines. In this template, you'll notice that certain branches have the text type listed on. For any branch with the text type listed, that's where you're going to enter your custom information. You can see that we have key assessments, key problems, supporting data, and current medications. To begin entering your text, left click the desired branch and highlight the corresponding text. Either delete or retype your updated text, and then simply left click on the white space. This will update the branch text. We can then move on to the first key assessment. I left click the type key assessment branch, highlight the corresponding text, and either delete or just retype my updated text and left click on the white space. We can move forward with the first key problem. Locate the Type Key Problem branch, left click and highlight the corresponding text, and add the new updated text. Again, left click on the white space to update the branch text itself. We will finish this template with the current medication by left clicking, highlighting, and updating the corresponding text as needed. If there are any branches that are not required or any data that is not needed, you can simply left click on the desired branch and hit the delete key on your keyboard. To delete multiple branches, simply draw a marquee and hit the delete key. Here is an example of a completed template with the corresponding diagnosis, key assessments, key problems, and medication. You notice that there are some branch connection lines within the map. Those can easily be created under the Insert tab, Branch Connection, by left-clicking the first branch, and then releasing the mouse button on the second branch. I can format that branch connection by left-clicking, going under the Format tab, changing the arrow style or property, changing the line color, as well as the line width. An advantage to using the MindView concept mapping software is that it's fully integrated with popular tools like Microsoft Word and Microsoft PowerPoint. When exporting to Microsoft Word, each individual branch will become a corresponding section in the Word document, and it will follow a clockwise order, starting at the 1 o'clock point. I go to File, Export, Microsoft Word, and Quick Word Export. This will convert my MindView document into a functional Word file with the image of the concept map, corresponding table of contents and page numbers, and I can scroll through and I can see each individual category or section that was listed within my map. 